First of four billions of pieces of personal protective equipment have now been produced since the start of the pandemic, and many of which have already been used, saved, or simply thrown out. But those stocking up on their own supply could be in for a bit of a surprise. NBC4's Matthew Herchik spoke with one PPE manufacturer about the important date that consumers should be keeping an eye on. Masks, hand sanitizer, even gloves and COVID-19 tests, they all have expiration dates. And if you didn't know that, PPE manufacturers say that you could soon be at risk for reduced protection against COVID-19. Anything that has an FDA approval needs to have an expiration date. March of 2020 saw many people begin stocking up on things like masks, gloves and hand sanitizer. But the shelf life could soon be running out on many of those products. So masks is two years. Gloves is about two and a half, three years on average, some as low as two. While studies show hand sanitizer can remain effective for up to five years, COVID-19 tests present an unknown for distributors. Almost 100% of all COVID tests have their expiration dates extended by three to six months versus what's on the box. Because they don't know how long the ingredients of the test last because they're so new. So where can consumers find the expiration date? By law, it can be found on the packaging of any FDA approved product. But there are other ways to identify compromised PPE. They deteriorate, they rip, they become brittle. Becoming less effective in their protection against COVID-19. Leo Friedman is the CEO of iPromo.com. His company shifted production during the pandemic and began shipping millions of units of PPE across the United States and Canada. The billions of masks were manufactured in the spring of 2020, two years ago now. And that's why it's becoming such a major issue. Friedman recommends writing down the expiration date as soon as you receive any shipment of protective gear and double checking any dates before using the product. PPE is always stored, shipped in bulk. It is new product but it might have been sitting in the warehouse. As for those expired products, PPE manufacturers say some protection is still better than none, but they recommend that you recycle those expired products and equip yourself with new PPE. Local for you in Columbus, Matthew Herchik, NBC4.